Hi guys, guys. welcome Welcome to to Ecology Ecology Talks. Talks. Today, we're talking about one of the greatest ecological mysteries, eels. Until recently, many facets of the European eel life cycle have remained unknown and unobserved. But as this species faces extinction, we now must use our tools of ecological study to learn how to help them. Eels are a strange looking fish that many people associate with silty rivers or perhaps a tasty meal. They don't quite resemble a typical fish with their snake-like body and lack of traditional scales, but their ecological and cultural impact is immense. There are over 800 known eel species, but today we'll focus on the European eel. European eels are members of the Anguilla genus, which includes 19 extant species of freshwater eels. Unfortunately, in the late 1970s, there was a severe drop in the population of European eels, and many scientists theorized that the main causes of such a drastic decrease was due to a reduced population of spawning eels caused by overfishing, pollution, and habitat loss, as well as reduced larval survival due to changes in oceanic conditions caused by climate change. European eels have since been listed as critically endangered by the IUCN, meaning that they have a 50% chance or greater of facing extinction in the next 10 years or three generations. To save the eels, we must first understand a few things about them, such as their life history and important habitats. Their biology is heavily dependent on their behavioral and ecological adaptability to their current environment, and they exhibit extensive plasticity throughout their lives. Eels are able to tolerate a wide variety of environmental conditions, such as changes in temperature, salinity, and even ecosystem. They are considered habitat generalists and are able to fill a wide range of niches in each environment. Why then would an animal that seems so resilient be so severely at risk? Well, let's start with their habitat needs. European eels depend on several habitats to complete their life cycle. They are metamorphic and migratory, meaning that an individual eel will live in and travel through a number of aquatic ecosystems throughout its lifetime. Thanks to a 2022 study, we now know that European eels migrate to the Sargosa Sea to breed, covering a distance of thousands of miles. The eel life cycle consists of six main stages, egg, larva, or leptocephalus, glass eel, elvert, yellow eel, and silver eel. The eggs and leptocephali exist only in the ocean, where the eggs are laid and develop into leptocephali. The leptocephali are detritivores that feed on marine debris such as feces and marine snow. The energy accumulated during this phase will carry them through their metamorphosis into glass eels. The glass eels then grow into elvers, which are opportunistic benthic feeders, which eventually develop into yellow eels. At the elver and yellow eel stage, the eels live in freshwater, usually in rivers, feeding on insect larvae and small fish, where they can live for decades before making their final migration back into the sea, at which point they become silver eels. In the transition from yellow eel to silver eel, the eels stop eating and their digestive organs change into their reproductive organs. As a Simulparis species, the eels will die after breeding, so there is no need for them to digest food once their final migration begins. Instead, the remaining energy is used to complete their journey and find a mate. To prevent the ultimate demise of such an interesting species, conservation efforts seek to reduce fishing to sustainable levels, make eel migrations safer and easier for the silver eels returning to the Sargossa Sea, and the glass eels migrating to their freshwater habitats, and restock their rivers throughout Europe with young eels. All of these efforts rely on understanding how the eels function and thrive, so unraveling the mystery of the eel life cycle and migratory pathways of these extraordinary animals might not just be a fascinating ecological puzzle, but also the answer to how the enigmatic eel can be saved.